tube. It's been a while, but uh, finally able to do that test I was talking about. And at the top here, I have the Harbor Freight 100 watt kit. And at the bottom, I've got the Mono Crystalline 100 watt. The sun is out right now, and that's the difference between the two. It's obvious the Mono puts out a lot more than the Harbor Freight does. I'm drawing about oh, 25 amps on my power inverter right now. So these are the only two panels I have hooked up. And this is the charge controller. I'm getting about 9.6 between the two of them. And the sun, it's a clouds come and go. Uh, sun's right up there. I did notice a minute ago when a cloud went over, um, they were pretty matched. I had uh, 1.7 amps on the mono and 1.4 on the Harbor Freight. So there wasn't a whole lot of difference when the cloud went over. But with the sun out like it is, the mono does a lot better. So there you go. Now, uh, as it gets later in the evening, I'm going to do this test again and see which one performs in lower light. Because uh, they were pretty close when the cloud went over. So maybe, you know, 300 milliamps difference between the two, which isn't that much. So anyway, there we go. Finally comparing the two together. It's a mess now. I have to clean all this up to put it back the way it was. I'm not, of course, leaving it like this. So I shall get back with you uh, later on this evening. It's almost 5 o'clock on the same day, and I find it interesting. These meters don't come on unless they have a little bit of a current draw. Um, the mono is not producing anything. The Harbor Freight panel is producing about a half an amp, or over a half an amp. And these are the conditions now. It's cloudy, no sun. Somewhere over there, it's four o'clock or almost five, and that's what we're getting now. Harbor Freight, just over half an amp, about three quarters of an amp, and this just shut off because there's no amperage going through it at all, or it's too low for it to pick it up. The instructions say if it's under 200 milliamps. Uh, it won't uh, come on. So. Still pulling 25 amps here. I'm not getting any charge. Uh, there's that 0.7 amp coming in off of the Harbor Freight. So there's your comparison. It looks like uh, the mono kicks butt in the sun. And Harbor Freight does produce some in very low light. So that'll be your decision on what you like. So I guess they work hand in hand pretty good. So there's my take on that. And I guess you can make your own decisions which one you like. Alright, well, as always, thanks for watching. Bye.